Hello everybody, I'm Frida Stauffer. I uh, just got back from the doctor. I went to see my asthma doctor. I got uh, a flu shot and a pneumonia shot. And the pneumonia shot is a new one that I you only need to take once in a lifetime. So I'm happy to have that. Um, hopefully it'll protect me from getting pneumonia again in, in the future. I don't know if it can protect against COVID pneumonia or not, but it, I hope it does. Um, and um, the next thing they gave the flu shot, I already had the flu this year, but the flu is going, uh, usually has uh, type, a, uh, type A and type B, so I hope I don't get type B. <laughs> or if I do, I hope it's not real, real bad. Um, I was going to take my COVID booster today, but I um, decided since I had those other two shots, I can wait a little bit. <laughs> Maybe next month I'll get it. Um, I've, I've stepped on the scale. Of course, I, they always make me step on the scale. And I've lost weight. I started um, working on losing weight at the end of October. And now it's the end of November, so in one month I've lost 11 pounds. <laughs> in one month, that's good. Um, Leia, are you scared? Are you scared you might have to ride the zip line? <laughs> the, one, the way I usually know I'm losing weight is that my chin right here starts to, starts to uh, move back, my double chin. And I have more space between my uh, the bone of my chin and, and, and the next chin. <laughs> so my second chin starts shrinking. That's how I know I'm losing weight. I, I thought I did, but I wasn't sure how much. So I've lost 11 pounds in one month. Including, that's including cheating at Thanksgiving. Uh, on Thanksgiving week, I, I wasn't uh, very careful. Um, so now... For lunch, I'm having uh, steamed asparagus. And after I steam them, because I don't like watery uh, steamed vegetables, I sauteed it until the liquid was evaporated. And I have a protein wrap here with some fried bologna in it and some um, toasted uh, uh, mozzarella cheese. So this one is not real crunchy like my... Uh, Wraps sometimes are. This one is a little bit softer because um, the bologna and cheese cooking with it kept it softer. Bismillah. This bag just tastes sweet to me. Since I don't eat sugary foods, I did on Hassan's birthday. <laughs> I ate cake and ice cream. But since I rarely eat sweets anymore, things I don't usually consider sweet taste sweet. Mmm. <laughs> So yesterday, the kids got to come home early, and um, they, um, of course, were very happy. But the storm wasn't as severe, and it didn't come as early as as it was anticipated to. It came. Quite a bit later and it rained heavy thundered a little but it wasn't nearly as bad as what was expected so the kids had a great um, short day of school yesterday 
So I'm watching um, <clears throat> a show on Netflix. It's about um, I forgot its name. Flavorful Origins or something. It's uh, in China. It's in Chinese. But it has um, English subtitles and they show all kinds of different foods and ways of preparing foods that people in, in China, in local places in China, they, how they prepare it. It's nothing like what we eat in a Chinese restaurant in the United States. <laughs> Although I like Chinese restaurants. Ours is American Chinese food. <laughs> This wrap tastes real good. I taste the sweetness and the texture of the asparagus. I taste the salt in the bologna. And I taste the texture of the cheese. And uh, the texture of the wrap. That's a protein wrap from Aldi. I like that and I like the protein bread too. Asparagus that has been frozen has a different texture than asparagus that are sautéed when they're fresh.
I didn't have breakfast today because I knew I was going to step on the scale. <laughs> I always uh, step on the scale when I'm, when I know I'm stepping on the scale, I, I don't want to eat. So I have hope. I have even more hope that I can lose weight because for now, I am not taking steroids anymore on a daily basis. We're giving it a try. I still have chronic fatigue. Um, ever since I had COVID pneumonia over a year ago, I still have chronic fatigue. Um, it doesn't matter what I eat or what I don't eat. Doesn't matter which medicine I skip or take. Um, I always, I'm always the same. So I know it's um, related to something else. I have a BiPAP for my sleep apnea. Mm, I'm gonna drink this broth here because it's from the asparagus. Sweet. <sighs> All right. That was a 13 minute video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Have a beautiful and blessed week. Thanks God for everything. Bye-bye.